Oji Moni Oji is the new song that has been enjoying uh, enjoying airplay since it got released by Donald Kwa, who is a new gospel artist on the music scene. Before we get into the chit chat, I want to wish a happy birthday to my friends Lydia Asari and Edna Apia. It's your birthday today, girls. I hope you enjoy every bit of it, and I dedicate the song to you. But Donald, tell us about Boji Moni Uji. What does okay. that mean, first of all? Okay, actually, um, the, the word Boji Moni Uji was, was coined out of the Bible. Um, if you read Exodus 3, we have mm. a story there where um, Moses has an encounter with God through the burning bush. And um, God sets him on a mission to deliver the children of Israel. And he asks God, um, what do I say when I go to, to Egypt? And God said, tell them that I am that I am has mm. sent you. Mm. So literally what we are saying in, in Ga, translated in Ga, um, you are who you are, Boji Moni Uji, that's in Ga, yeah. That is the God that has sent you mm. to deliver the children of Israel. But you've been in the industry for how long? How long have you been singing for? Um, I've been doing um, praise and worship in my local church for over 10 years. Which church? ICGC. Mm. Awoshi, Awoshi Assembly. Right. So it was last year I decided to record um, some of the songs that God has blessed me with. Mm -hmm. So this is my first single. Um, Buji Moni Uji, yeah, and that is what is out now. And how has it been going? Since so far, it? Hey, it has been very good. Um, I've had the opportunity to, to visit a few places and um, people give me feedback and they're like, the song is a blessing. So I have no doubt the song is anointed, it's a blessing and, and it continues to be a blessing. Do you have any challenges because you're singing in Ga? Because last week, I had two musicians here, uh, me, Fanny and Tishi Boy, who were complaining okay. that uh, the Ga songs were not getting as much airplay as they would love. Do you have uh, similar problems? Um, I would say, um, personally, what I've realized is that a lot of people are inclined more to the Akan songs. Right. Um, maybe because they are more in number. Mm. And um, I also feel that maybe uh, people are kind of a bit they are lazy to learn the gun okay so you have a lot of people tell you um, um i can't learn it because they feel they don't want to learn it, it i think it's, it's a personal decision mm. but i mean we have nice songs in Ga that if you take your time and just listen through the song you realize it's nothing difficult we learn nigerian songs right we learn south african songs we sing them in our churches in, in our schools wherever but i think we are a bit lazy to learn the gun and I think it's a personal decision. We decide we don't want to learn it. So that, that's affecting you? That's affecting the I wouldn't Ghana say musicians. it's affecting. Uh, I think that uh, people who are in the media and um, people who are out there who, who promote some of, some of our music, mm. I think that if they decide to push it, I think it will go. Because once it's on the airways, on the TV stations, and people hear it, they'll fall in love with it. They'll begin to sing it and like it. I think we just need support. Now, how are you finding the gospel music industry? Because some people have said, I've heard them say that, you know, now the gospel musicians are more focused on the glitz, the glamour, uh, rather than, you know, worshipping and praising God in their songs. What do you make of that? Okay, um, for me, I believe that um, if you're a gospel musician, mm -hmm. you're not called to yourself. It's, it's a mission, it's an assignment, it's a calling. And um, just like the Bible says that, um, there are many members, but we are all one body. Um, Jesus Christ is the head, and we. So you find yourself maybe being the neck or the hand. So you have a purpose to fulfill. You haven't. You mustn't go your own way. So you need to understand your mission. You need to understand what you are called to do in the house of God, and just do that. Um, I mean, I think some people are driven away by the money, the glitz, and the mm -hmm. glamour, like mm -hmm. you are saying. Mm -hmm. But um, I think you just need to be focused. And, and when you are focused, then you begin to please your master, mm. which is God. And, and in his sight, you, might be doing the, you will be doing the right thing. Um, maybe you might not have the approval of, of people, but I think that we should seek to always please God. But do you think more should be done for uh, gospel musicians? Like we're talking about money, they complain that you know, they're not giving um, opportunities to perform here and there. So when they get the chances at the churches, they mention all these prices because they are doing the work of God, but they also need to pay their producers and all that. Do you think more should be done in the industry for gospel mus uh, musicians? Um, I believe that it's, it's an equal playing field. Um, people who do other genre of music, whether secular or whatever, mm. 
Um, I think that gospel musicians too should understand the terrain and um, be able to also put what they have out there. So it, it, it's, it's an industry on its own. You need to brand yourself well. You need to know the way you, you present yourself when you go to places. And um, if you do those things, I think that you go well. We have a lot of people now. We have the contemporary gospel uh, coming up. And I know a lot of guys who are doing pretty well. Mm -hmm. So I think um, it's how you present yourself, how you brand yourself, and I think you do good. You're talking about music and uh, what kind of music should be done in the brand and all that. Let's talk about you. What kind of music do you do as Donald Qual? Okay. So um, I'll classify myself um, in the bracket of contemporary gospel music. Mm -hmm. um, I, I, I see myself to be very versatile. Right. And um, Actually, this is my first single, but I have a lot of songs that cuts across all genres, so reggae, whatever, um, I do it, that's, that's me. Mm -hmm. um, so I don't, I don't see myself having a limitation to a particular genre, but I think that talking about it broadly, um, I think I fall under the contemporary gospel um, music. But who are those that you listen to? Who are those that kind of inspire and influence you both locally and internationally? Who do you look up to? A lot of people. So um, when you come to Ghana, we, we have the likes of um, Eugene Zuta, mm. um, he's a great inspiration and he's a personal friend. Um, the likes of Kodak, Joe Metal. Um, if you go international, you mm. go to um, South Africa, we have Dr. Tumi, um, a, a whole lot. Um, Israel Houghton. So these people are an inspiration, listen to them and I mean, you get a lot of inspiration. So what are some of the projects that you're working on? Do you have an album, you know? Okay, so like... hold a concert yeah. in the future. What are the projects? So actually this song, um, I recorded it last year during my maiden event. Um, the, the theme for the event, event was um, Jesus Exalted. Mm. So at that event, I was able to record um, about five of my songs. And um, this happens to be the first one that I've released. So. Within the course of this year, I'll release the rest. But also, um, in December, I'll have another program that is Jesus Exalted. Right. Yeah. Can you tell us a bit about that? We're wrapping up. It's, I just wanted uh, okay. to it's a, a it's, it's, it. it's a gospel program um, organized in my local church mm. um, for believers to come together and to worship and to praise God. And we take advantage to also record some new songs. So yeah. where do your fans follow you on social media? If they want your song, where can they get it? Let your fans know. Okay, so you can get it on um, all the social media handles, mm. um, Facebook, Instagram, you just go you search for Donald Kwao. Right. Um, Instagram, Twitter, you can get me Kwao Donald. Um, all the other social media handles, just type Donald Kwao, YouTube, you get me. And how do we get Boji Moniuji? <laughs> exactly. So when you go to, um, as I said, all the other all social media handles, mm -hmm. you, can get, you can get the song there. Mm. Yeah. You can also go to YouTube. Um, you can you can check out the song. You can you can like my page, subscribe to my channel, and um, yeah. Any final words for the people that love do not qual already? Okay, so I'd just like to say that um, gas songs are not difficult to learn. Mm. You just need to um, play the song. I'll say Boji Moni, you just play it twice, and you can get a line. I believe you can even say Boji Moni Oji. Boji Moni Oji. Exactly, and and, and you are good to go. So just go. To the social media handles check out the song just love it enjoy it use it for your morning devotion in the afternoon in the night mm. it's an anointed song and it will be a blessing thank to you. you so much for joining Welcome. us do not call do not call it's a brand new artist that is just trying to make it and he's saying that just buy his songs don't just download and enjoy <laughs> buy it let him make some money out of it and enjoy and enjoy boji Money, money. Boji. Great. <laughs>